hello there guys and uh, welcome back to my channel and how are you all today and it's Kev Allman here I'd like to thank you all to invite me on another video again I'm so glad you can join me and you come to support my channel to keep my channel to get my channel growing and uh, thank you ever so much to subscribe to my channel always remember to hit the bell notification and it's so you guys are Oh, awesome and absolute fabulous. So, first of all, I will do another read aloud video of Disney Cla Disney stories. I will show you have got Disney Pixar Finding Nemo. If anyone haven't seen, if anyone seen Finding Nemo, it was such a good. I really love Finding Nemo. It's such a good film since I was a child. It's been released in back in 2003, I presume. And if there was a sequel of uh, Finding Dory. So, I'm glad you enjoyed um, watching Read Aloud Disney stories so far. You guys will really love this so much. I appreciate it. Especially our uh, SM artists. They do like um, reading the storybooks to us, audience, to us viewers. Including myself. Okay, so let's begin reading to you guys this magnificent Finding Nemo storybook. Okay, let's begin. Nemo, the little clownfish, couldn't wait for his first day at school, but his father Merlin was nervous. His son was small and not much of a swimmer yet. Merlin left Nemo with a Mr. Way. The teacher but then he found out the class was going on a trip to drop off. And beyond, that was a dangerous open sea. Merlin raced off to find a group. Nemo and his new friends, Tad, Sheldon and Pearl, sneaked away to look over the drop off. When they spotted the bottom of a boat, Sheldon challenged Nemo to swing closer to it, but before Nemo could answer, Merlin arrived. You can't do that, Nemo, yelled Merlin anxiously. Nemo was angry and, and set off towards the boat, but then a diver appeared. He caught Nemo in the net and got back on the boat and sped off. The diver was Dr. Sherman, the dentist from Australia. He caught Nemo into the aquarium with a group of fish who called himself the Tank Gang. A friendly pelican called Nigel perched on the windowsill to chat with them. Nemo learned that was going to be a present for the dentist's niece, Dada, and Dada's last pet fish hadn't survived. I have to get back to my dad, cried Nemo. The leader of a tank gang girl promised to help a little fish escape. Meanwhile, Merlin was desperate to find his son. He met the blue fish called Dory, who offered to help. She had a terrible memory She was, and was always forgetting things, but... Found, did find a diving mask just like like the one one by the man who napped Nemo. Something was written on the mask. Suddenly, Dory remembered she could read human. She started to read by the light of an angler fish. It was the dress. Peef Sherman, forty two Willoughby, Ray, Sydney. Merlin asked the group of moonfish how to get to Sydney. They pointed the way. When they came to the trench, some swim through it and not over it. They warned, but when Merlin and Dory got there, it looked too scary to swim through. Merlin tricked Dory 
into swimming over the trench. But there was a danger. Hundreds of jellyfish, Dory and Merlin, bounced from a jellyfish to a jellyfish to cross the trench. Dory got caught by one of the jellyfish, but Merlin freed her. Then everything went black and went he awoke. He was riding on the turtle called Crush. Crush was on his way to Sydney, so Merlin and Dory hitched the ride. Merlin told the turtles about his search for Nemo, and they passed the story on to the other sea creatures. Soon, the Nigel the Pelican heard, heard about it. In Sydney Harbour, Merlin and Dory searched all night for the dentist's boat. Then at dawn, they scooped up in the huge beak of a hungry pelican. No, said, said screamed Merlin. He tickled the pelican's throat and the bird caught, coughed them up onto the pier. Just then, Nigel landed nearby. He knew that Merlin must be of Nemo's father. Hop, in, hop inside my beak, he told Merlin. I'll take you to your son. Back at the dentist, Dr. Sher Dr. Sherman put Nemo in the bag of water to give it to Darla. Nemo played dead. Hoping that hey, they'd flush him down the toilet, suddenly Nigel and Merlin and Dory appeared. What the? exclaimed the dentist, dropping the bag and shouting Nigel out of the window. Nemo flopped out of the bag and Dada made a grab for him, but the tank gun came to the rescue and helped Nemo to escape by the spit sink. Whoosh! He shut down the plug hole and plugged and perched through the pipes. It was quite a ride. Back in the harbour, Merlin sadly said goodbye to Dory and Nigel. He swam past the drainage pipe and started the long journey home. Moments later, Nemo popped out of the pipe. Have you seen my dad? Nemo asked some crabs, but the crabs tried to eat him, so Nemo swam off in the opposite direction to Merlin. Soon, Nemo found Dory. I think I, think I lost someone, somebody, she said sadly. Then suddenly she remembered. Nemo, I, f I know your father, she cried. Dory and Nemo made the crabs tell them about Merlin and they set off after him. Nemo spotted his dad in the shoal of fish just in time to see them all got get caught in a huge net. Nemo told the fish to swim towards the ocean floor. The net, the net snapped and everyone was free. Nemo and his father were reunited. They took Dory back to the reef and Nemo started school again. But just as the lesson was about to begin, Nemo swam to Merlin and gave him a big, a great big hug. Love you, Dad, he said. I love you too, son, said Merlin. Now go have an adventure. Well, this is the end. Okay, so um, I hope I hope you I I hope you loved my story about reading a story book of Finding Nemo. I think Finding Nemo was a good classic Disney Pixar film ever. Especially especially you have seen Toy Story. I think. It, you're already familiar with Pixar films as well. A 3D computer animated feature film. And that's it for all guys. And 
you have already subscribed to my channel to hear the spell for notification you can also check out my social media on the description down below for this video you can find me on instagram twitter and pinterest on tiktok if you're interested to find me if you want to spot my content that'd be absolutely fabulous okay so um that's it for all and i hope you enjoyed this video and and thank you ever so much and see you next time